Leviosa, not Leviosa. Let me just um, magic what we're doing today on the table, okay? Because um, <laughs> I am magic, so, you know. Ready, three, two, one. Sit, sit. Hello, everyone. <laughs> Do you just love it? <laughs> Look a quiet, a choral person. <laughs> right, so, uh, yes, I am wearing my Harry Potter Ravenclaw robe dressing gown. <laughs> and yes, I am magic, so. <laughs> I'm actually quite warm in this because it has been terrifyingly hot weather recently. Actually, it's really rainy today, really cold. I'm still quite warm in this, but I'm going to keep it on for the purpose of the video. I love these sleeves. Look at how look at how nice these sleeves are. Today is the birthday haul video. Ironically, I'm filming this on my sister's birthday. Hence the cards in the background. This is the card that I got her. Um, that's her in her lovely Patrick Star anorak. Here's all her favourite groups and all her husbands at the bottom. Another husband on the back. I actually put in the middle of the card that the title of this card is The Husbands of Rats. That's what we call a Raz. Let's crack on with the. Oh. I'm going to keep doing this forever. With the unboxing obviously i could just unbox it but since i've got my magic wand we're just gonna a flick of the wrist swish and flick i mean we're not levitating it but i don't know what the spell is to make something appear oh accio i could just do accio couldn't i um okay so accio albums so look at that did you, did you see that I magic that. We've got two albums and a light stick to unbox here. So the first album we're going to unbox today is Solar in Midas first mini album and that is Solar from Mamma Moo and I call her Solar, Solar in Midas because that's a way that you say my name is Solar or I'm Solar. I don't know why I call her that, I just do. I don't know what you're eating but you should stop it right now. Say it. What are you doing? So funny. She's been really excited about it. What is so funny? Do you want to be a, a magician? No, okay. So let me does. First mini album, Face. And I love this album. Um, primarily because the title track, Honey, Honey is like one of my favorite songs ever. It's such an amazing song. The dance is great as well. Can I open it please? This isn't a pre, I don't know whether, no, this wasn't a pre-order because this came out ages ago. Um, this came out like April, I think. Well, it's not a pre-order, so don't get any pre-order benefits. And it was given to me by Master Star. Um, so let's crack open the album. Wow, look, it's just floating. Look, I'm a bunch of just floating. stuff's in the face. All of this stuff is in the face. <laughs> so we do get some pre-order stuff. Right, so I love the, the yellowness. I do like the colour yellow. Um, I love this outfit primarily because um, it looks so incredibly comfortable because it's all fluffy and all yellow. Imagine getting hot sweaty when you're dancing there, it would make it a bit gross. I'm loving the honeycomb vibes that we're getting as well. That's a nice picture. That's a nice picture. Look at this picture, this is really funny. <laughs> she means business, looking at her honeycomb hive for the day. Okay. Here's all her dancers. The dancers. So do we start walking around with an feet? More pictures, mirror pictures. I've got this thing. We've got Raw. I think this must be an intro song because like hardly any lyrics there. Okay. Oh, green solar now. Solar in nature. Solar in nature. And here's the honey lyrics which was written by Sola, So Young 
Be and Kim Do Hyun. There's the lyrics for that. Don't, you probably can't see them at all, can you? They're at the bottom. Just believe they're at the bottom. They are. Oh, some white solar now. Some white solar. Actually, the dress is more pinky. And this is Chap Chap. Lyrics to Chap Chap. Some white solar. Yeah. It's a horse or a dragon. There's solar with a horse and a dragon. Got big booty. Lyrics. All I want for my bye bye is a big booty, huh? I don't want that. But the <laughs> white solar with the face. Wonder why the song, their album is called Face. Probably because there's a massive face in the music video. There she is with her long ass hair. Well, that's heavy, that must be like disgustingly heavy. And this is Newspaper Solar. She can turn anything into a dress. There's Newspaper Solar, there she is. God, this book is giant. Newspaper Solar, and this is Zingle, Zingle, Zingle. Um, lyrics. I only really like Honey off the album, but you know, Honey's enough because it's a great song. There's the credits and the disc. There's the credits and the disc. There we go. And then we've got a couple of things that fell out. So we've got this. I don't know what this is. Um, what was she? There's something on the inside. And there's, we've got this picture and it also has some text on the back, which I'll try and translate. Don't know how well it's gonna be able to translate um, handwriting though. Hello. Another day goes by like this. This is my letter to you. Thank you for always being by my side and supporting me. I will be by your side no matter what happens. I will always be your strength. A lonely, sad and gloomy day, moment by moment. I hope this letter gives you strength. You are a really wonderful person. It is the only jewel in this world. I'm doing good enough now and it's great. Solo will always be your strength. Oh, that's lovely, isn't it? So, oh, oh. The English translation was at the bottom. So what it actually said was, hello, another day is passing by. This is a letter from me to you. Thank you for being my rock no matter what. I'll also stand by your side and be your rock through thick and thin. You might feel lonely, sad or depressed from time to time. When you do, I hope this letter can cheer you up. You're an amazing person. The one and only gem in the, same, in the entire world. You're already doing well and you're awesome. From solo, he'll always give you energy. So that's what he actually said. Okay, so I'm just an idiot who didn't read the bottom there. So that's a nice picture. Okay. Get back in. Then we've got some photo cards and whatever this is. Okay. So we've got this thing. So I guess it's just a little big photo card. There we go. Then we've got, oh, are these stickers? I don't know, are these stickers? I think these are stickers. What's, what's the deal with this? So we've got some stickers here, um, like this, and they're actually parts of Sola's face. So, yeah. I don't know how you rearrange them to make them look normal but there you go got a couple of other stickers as well my sleeves have just knocked everything off got the face logo and then a more face logo so love me some stickers and we've got two photo cards we've got a white solar with her signature on the back white solar there and then we've got another bee honey bee solar signature on the back there and there she is lovely Solar Imi Dara for everyone. Next album is one that I asked for like before this even came out. So I think they did pre-order this for me, which is why I've got the poster. So if you haven't already been able to tell, it is um, Nayon's debut album in Nayon. Right, let's start off with the poster. Sorry. Okay, we seem to have a massive poster again. So here we go, here we go. This is her in her lovely little bejeweled 
look at it. I don't know if you can see it all there. Can you see it? Can you see it? Okay, well, it's not okay. Well, there we go. Okay, you've seen it. You've seen it. Lovely. Right, then we've got this is um, a mirror. No, it's not. It's a badge. I haven't had a badge before. There I have. I've had some tea badges, but not a massive badge like this. Mm. Neon. She looks quite pixie-like here, doesn't she? It's neon. There we go. So we've got some, oh, some stickers. Got some stickers, lovely little stickers. Stickers, got some stickers. And then we've got this. I don't know what this is. Oh, we'll just bent it. What is this? I think you just put a photo card in it or something. Well, we'll try that out in a minute. Right, okay, let's open this guy. And we've got some shears in here. It's all the stuff. Let's look at the book first. Let's just... Okay, no, because everything's in there. So the disc is at the back. Disc is at the back. There's the disc, a little, little sofa. It's very purple, I like it. I don't know what version they got. Um, I think they got the neon version, although I, couldn't, I don't really know. So. Um, oh, what's in here? Nothing. Okay. So this is neon, purple neon. Purple neon, lovely. More purple neon. Okay, we've got the lyrics for Pop. I love Pop, Pop's a great song. And as I said before, the dance is so ridiculously hard, especially for a debut soloist. Even though she's been around for like seven years, so. Because she's had some cracking outfits for this one, but she also had some very questionable outfits, like the cherry outfit. It's just not my favourite at all. I actually like, don't mind the dress, but the head thing, no, you just need the head matching bit. Then we've got No Problem with Stray, featuring Felix and Stray Kids. I love this song as well. Very nice song. All in English. Okay, Love Countdown, featuring Wanstein. I like this song as well. P a pink neon. We've got some pink. Pink neon. Pink neon. There's some pink neon with a tiara. Little tiara. Candy floss. Lyrics. I don't know actually if you can see the lyrics at all because they're all white. All or nothing. Lyrics. La la la. Oh, and I am with a little sedgy bear. Look at that. It's lovely, isn't it? Oh, hat neon. Fluffy hat neon. I like that hat. It's very nice. Happy birthday to you. Lyrics. That's a very, very nice picture. That one. Lovely. That hat, hey, that hat looks really heavy. Then we've got, oh, okay. okay. I don't know what this is, so I'm gonna have to look it up. <laughs> Sunset by Nayon. Lyrics. Probably didn't get a good look at that. Yeah. Um, okay, I think this is the last few photos now of Hat Nayon. Hat Nayon. And then this is just the credits and the thanks and everything. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Right, let's open this. So in here we've got all the stuff. Okay, yeah. So this is... Oh, questions. Okay, so there's a little picture. On the back is some questions. As this is your first solo album on Twice, the feeling will be new. How do you feel? I was always a little worried and scared to sing and stand on stage by myself, but I feel like I've accomplished another challenge. Oh, lovely. Um, there isn't any English right now. Okay. Next question, question two. 
what message do you want to convey through the album? I, it was the first album I was preparing for myself without any members, so I was nervous and burdened, but I wanted to be perfect. I had lots of thoughts, but in the end, I am the most me. Oh, this is this Google Translate, it's not real. Um, have Fun, I think it's an album that I put a lot of effort into to enjoy. It's an album with so much happy and joyful energy, so it's like that for those who listen to my album. I hope I can convey some energy. Accomplished. Question three, all lovely and short, okay. Can you, what, what does the first solo album mean to Naon? Another challenge, adventure, fun, lovely. Doke. What part did you pay the most attention to while preparing for this album? I think the part I paid the most attention to myself was the part where I tried not to stress. I have a desire to do well, so there were times when I got Jupiter. That's not right, is it? That can't be right. There, there were times when I was greedy and dizzy because I wanted to do well, but I want to have fun as much as I can. He cleared his, that's not right, he cleared his head. That's not the right terms, I can't work from. The title song, I cleared my head. The title song, Pop, what song is it? Pop is a song that I can sit still and listen to by my standards. A song with a plump charm that makes you want to get up and dance. Yeah, it does, yeah. The chord, among the songs on the list, if you could pick one that you are most attached to, Everyone would expect it to be a song I wrote, but it's not. It's Happy Birthday to You. It was a song that reminded me of a lot of subjects I really wanted to sing while singing, of course, including words. Nayon. Nayon's words of support to Nayon. Cheer up, enjoy fighting. Question eight. A word to once who waited for Nayon solo. There must be onces who have been waiting for a long time and there must be onces who were surprised. Although it will be a short promotion period, I hope it will be a good memory and I hope that my album will be a good memory for a long time. Yeah, yeah, absolutely, yeah. Now we've got two questions that are either from Gio and Sana or to Gio and Sana. Can't decide what it is. Um, okay, Sana's written one piece. A word to me on preparing for her first solo album from Sana. Oh yeah, it's 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 too summer. It has finally been released to the world. Even in our team, there have been times when we have thought that someone will come out as a solo artist, but it's so strange to have that day in our hands right now, isn't it? That's so summer's speech. And more than anyone else, I'm so grateful to know that it must have been a great challenge for my uni. Thank you, so that means older sister. Thank you so much, you worked hard. Congratulations and thank you again. The pressures album for the nine of us ahead has increased. No, not for the nine of us has increased. Let's fight healthy from start to finish for the music program that will start from now on. Twice, twice, do well, old sister Sanaga. And now Gio. Oh, Gio, I can't read your handwriting. Sana's got a lovely handwriting. Um, okay, 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 okay. Can you, okay. A word from now to preparing for again, this is the same question. Okay, congratulations on your sister's first solo. It must have been difficult to prepare together during the twice schedule, but you worked hard. Go sprinkle it all and come. I'll, I'm always cheering for you, so please come back well fighting, okay? How lovely, okay? That wasn't the perfect, most perfect translation because it's Google Translate, so. Now we're gonna look at these little vote cards. I didn't realize what this was, but I think you're supposed to collect multiple of them and put them together. So you'd have like, it's spelt Im Nayan and her underneath every single letter. I've got M. There she is, lovely. So we've got this like Polaroid one of her with a lot of bows around everything. There we go. Then we've got one of her in her like checkered outfit. I really like that outfit. Lovely. Then we've got two photo cards here with her signature on the back. So there's the signatures. And then we've got purple nail again. And then we've got all oh, the pink outfit. I actually really liked this outfit because again, it looked really comfortable. And there we go. So this is, um, I actually have all the light sticks that I want that can be found. I do have four that I want that have not yet been found on the interwebs by me or my sister. Very annoying. I can't find IOIs, I can't find rocket punches, I can't find eye zones, and I can't find dream catchers. So we're now going through the ones that we don't necessarily think are like the most attractive. 
or the ones that we really want, but we want to get them all, so this is like the next one. So, however, I do think this one is very nice. So, this is SF9's Light Stick. Um, and this is one I actually do want, um, even though I've just said all that. I do want, I did want this one because it looks very like scepter-like and I like that. I just need a throne now, I've got a chair that looks like a throne actually. Um, open, open it, to goodness sake. Okay, here we go. If you could kindly open that would be great. Oh, oh that looks lovely to see. Ooh, we've got a little pack of stuff. Pack of stuff, right, okay. So we do have a photo card that came with it. It's one of the generic ones, but it actually is appropriate for the thing that was bought. It's an SF9 one. I have no idea who this is, so please tell me who it is, because I don't actually know anyone in SF9, apart from Ruwoon, Hui Young, and In Song. So this is all of them, but I don't know who's who. So we're gonna have to have a look, we're gonna look better. So we're gonna go ahead and say that this is Young Bean. No, that's not Young Bean. Is that Young Bean? Who are you? Let's do we look in the back. Chani. You your Chani. Yes, your Chani. If this is wrong, please feel free to roast me in the comments because I should know this. Oh no, actually I shouldn't know this because I don't follow SF9 that closely. So this is Chani, I believe. This is Chani. Yeah? Is that Chani? No? Is it Chani? Or is it no? No, you're definitely Chani, aren't you? Yes, that's definitely Chani. I think. Okay, this is Hui Young. They say it on the back. So <laughs> Never mind. Yeah, this is Chani because it says it on the back. I'm an idiot. Um, yep, so there's Chani. Here's Hui Young. Okay, here is Tae Young. I believe he now goes by Yu Tae Young, because that's his full name. There we go, there's Tae Young. Here is Zuho. Not Suho, Zuho. Next is Rawoon. That doesn't look like Rawoon. Does that look like Rawoon? That, looks, that looks, doesn't really look exactly like Rawoon. Rawoon. There's Rawoon. Rawoon. He's not doing, currently doing the performance uh, of any song because he's busy. This is Dewan. You Dewan that I want. Dewan. You Dewan that I want. Uh -uh -uh -uh. To one. Here is who are you? Jay Yoon. Jay Yoon. Lovely. This is In Song. I know you. I know In Song. And then finally, we've got Young Bin, who's the leader. Young Bin. Thank God they were in order. And thank God they had the names on the back because I'd be useless as well. <laughs> so then this must be. This must be Young Bin. This must be Young Bin because it looks like him. Okay. Anyway, let's carry on. Here is the light stick. How do you get it out? Oh yeah, doesn't that look lovely? It's like very scepter-like, isn't it? It's very scepter-esque. It's got um like a crystal cage with SF9 in the middle and there's like loads of golden rings around it. Can you see? Can you see? Um okay, let's try and put this in because I've never had any luck with these. I shall Oh, lovely. William's first time this time. Okay, there we go. Now let's read the instructions. So we need... Where is the 
batteries. Okay, three AAA batteries. I stopped off at the shop to get three AAA batteries. Um, I didn't know which ones I need, so I've got those. So we've got some AAA batteries. I planned ahead for this. I'm just really, really amazing. So I never usually get this done. I usually have to leave the room to find some batteries. Why are you doing that? Stop it. There you go. We've got, pressing this button will um, change the sequence from white, white blink, white flicker, and then off. So we've got white. Oh, that's bright, isn't it? That's lovely and bright. Here's, oh, that's lovely. That is cheddar gorge. That is cheddar gorge. Okay, so this is white flicker. No, white, this is white blink, it's white blink. White blink, and we've got white flicker. Oh, that's very epileptic, isn't it? Okay, and then off. So yes, here we have SF9's light stick version two. It's very, very sleek and clean looking, very nice. Definitely one of the nicer light sticks I've got. I think these gold things do move. A bit, anyway. So there it is. Hi Says, do you like the light stick? This is very like, very bright. I could probably use it as a torch when I go outside in the night time to take care of it for a way. It's very bright. A lot of them, you can't actually see the, the brightness on screen because of how dull they are. But um, this one you can. <laughs> it's like a little beacon. Why are you going underneath the table? Don't you dare knock over my stuff. Don't you dare. You finished? What are you looking at me for? And she's lying down. Okay, so let me just do a bit of clean up. So this time we're gonna do some magic clean up. So um, I don't really see them cast a spell in the, in the show, in the, the films when they, Kids Bop is on again. I have to watch the kids' channels because Sadie likes SpongeBob. Sadie likes SpongeBob. I like SpongeBob as well, but Sadie likes it to watch it when she's on her own. So I have to watch the kids' channels and Kids Bop is always bloody on. So annoying. Let me just tidy up with this magic one. Again, I don't see them actually casting a spell in the movies. They just kind of go like, mm, and it all just, you know, does it. So let's just sorry, sorry, quick, tidy up quick. Right, I'm gonna go now. Um, someone's moving again. I also have Stacey's album coming. By the way, A Beautiful Monster is a beautiful song. Um, I also have a Teaser's album coming, and I've seen the performance preview for that, and that looks beast. Um, so that's coming. Strongly recommend that you listen to Solar Imida's album and Nayon's album. Very nice. And obviously this is lovely. So, okay, I'm gonna go, bye. And three, two, one.